How's it going, YouTube? I uh, hope everybody's well. Johnny Wilson here from Nottingham Physio. Looking forward for another 30 minute um, class based on the science of health and longevity to improve your fitness levels, your independence, your quality of life. Today we've got a special class. We're going to do an EMOM. So an EMOM is what we call every minute on the minute. We're going to do this for 30 minutes. It's going to be the ultimate class. It's going to be incredibly difficult. And um, if there's an exercise in here that you're not able to do, substitute it with something else, okay? But more than anything, Let's get after it this morning, 30 minutes. So to start, we'll be doing about 50 seconds per exercise and there's a 10 second kind of leeway then to get you ready into the next exercise. So for the first exercise, we're gonna be doing step backs with overhead throw. Are we ready to get going with this, guys? Okay, so you can either start off with a weight or just start without a weight, whichever you prefer, but we are ready to get on with this 30 minutes. Three, two, one, and let's go. Okay, so starting off 50 seconds on step back to overhead throw. This is a day when we get right into it. Now, if you need to do a little bit of a warm up, just do it without the weights, and then you can start getting it into that way, okay? So just gradually building it up as we're going along. So every minute on the minute, a bit of a famous uh, CrossFit kind of a uh, um, a circuit, you know what I mean, with regards to what these guys do. Um, I love it. We're going to try and get in 30 exercises today, which is going to be phenomenal. So it's going to really challenge you. Um, and I'm really looking forward to it. So it's my first EMOM. Four seconds. <laughs> and okay, right. There's our first exercise. Got that last little bit, um, bit muddled up. Okay, now we're going into lateral raises. Three, two, one, and away we go. So I need to keep checking my phone today because we've got a lot of exercises to do. We are every minute on the minute and I don't want to miss out on anything. So it's about 50 seconds, like I was saying, for each exercise. And then that gives you 10 seconds to transition. 10 to 15 seconds, we can do 45 to 50 seconds, depending on how hard the exercise is. Okay, so here, we're working on shoulders. Again, use a lighter weight if it's a little bit strong to start off with. Good, come on guys. 10 more seconds, and then we're going into our third exercise already. Keep it going. Ooh. Three, two, and one. Two down. Okay, third exercise that we're doing, KB swings, kettlebell swings. So if you're struggling with the kettlebells, you don't have to worry about doing it. Pick a different exercise, do some squats. Ready, let's go. 45 to 50 seconds of kettlebell squats, kettlebell swings. Good, keep the back nice and straight. Use the hips, catch it, and then drive up. Do it excellently. 20 seconds gone on this one. takes a little bit of time to get used to kettlebell work. So don't be hard on yourself. Use, just pick a different exercise. And then in your own time, you can start practicing it. But it's a great exercise to do. Go 10 more seconds. And time on that one. Okay, three done. What have we got next? We are doing a squat. With a bottom up kettlebell. Okay, getting ready to go. So catch it in that position there, and then down we go. Four, three, two, one, up we come. Swing it, catch it, down we go. Four, three, two, one, good. Now you don't have to have the kettlebell upside down or anything like that. You can use a, a dumbbell, you can do it as an air, as a body weight squat. Okay, good. I like using this because it really tests the grip as well. Good. Come on, 15 seconds. It's an overall body exercise. Last 10 seconds of this. Good, you're doing brilliantly, guys. Oh, excellent. Okay, getting ready for the next exercise. And we're doing press-ups for 45 seconds. You heard me, you got this. Okay, you can take it nice and slow, whatever you need to do. 
We're getting ready to set and go. Press ups. Now you can do these on an incline. So you can do them against the wall. However you want to do them. Just get them done. You can do them on your knees. You can take some breaks in between. But all the time, we're just keeping pushing. It's 20 seconds gone. My first time doing this, Imam. So I can tell you right now, I'm already feeling it. But that's good. I don't want to wait till 26, 27 minutes in before I feel it. I want the work to start right at the start. Come on, last 10 seconds. Stay with it now. Be strong. Five, four, three, two, and one. Well done. Okay, getting ready for the next exercise. <coughs> we are doing ab crunches. So we're back on the floor again, okay? Let me just move these out of the way. We're doing 45 seconds of ab crunches. I hope you're feeling it already, because I know I certainly am. Okay, so getting into it, and away we go. Chin to chest, eyes to belly button, and up and down, just like that. Now it's tough to keep up with every minute on the minute. So you can always practice this class a few times when you get into that routine of it. Good. Keep going with it. 15 seconds to go. Chin to chest, ice to belly button. Keep working harder. Five seconds left. Three, two, and one. Good. Getting ready for the next exercise. The next one. Okay, we're doing single leg windmills. Okay, ready? Opposite hand to opposite leg. Down we go slowly for a count of 10. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Back up we come. We're only probably gonna get a couple of these done. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Back up you come. Two done. Down we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, Four, three, two, one. Three down on this side. Down we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Four down. We'll get one more done. Let's go. Away we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Well done. Let's check what's next on the list. Bicep curls. Okay. You are doing phenomenal. Ready? And let's go, guys. 45 seconds, and away we go. So pick a weight that's gonna challenge you. Really working hard for these 45 seconds. We are flying through this time. It's going really quick today. Just gotta keep it at it now, okay, good. Keep working at it. 20 seconds gone. After this exercise, we've got the other leg, or single leg windmills to do, okay? Doing brilliantly. Keep it going. Keep working hard at it. Good. 10 more seconds. Keep pushing it. Driving them up. Good form. Push yourself right to the end. Three, two, and time. Well done. Okay. Opposite leg for our single leg windmills, okay? Ready? And let's go. Down we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Good, one done. And then down we go again. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Two done. Doing excellently. And down we go again. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, three done. And we keep going after it. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 4 done. We'll get one more. And down we go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Outstanding. So then we're going to go with the opposite hand for our kettlebell, uh, upside down kettlebell swings and squats again. Ready, set, and let's go. Good, down we go. Five, 
four, three, two, one, up. And again, you don't need that kettlebell. One, two, three, four, five. Good. But it's great for shoulder work. Four, five. Great overall body exercise. A lot of control in this. Great for grip strength, which goes as we're getting older. Good. Good control all the way down into your squat. Keep it going. We've got one more of these to do. Good. Last one. Good. That's the first 10 minutes done. Already. Oh, outstanding. Okay. Let's see what's next on the list. Right. And we are doing our single arm deadlift with a kettlebell. You can do this with anything you want, okay? So we're just going to pick up and drop down 45 seconds, okay? So up and down and then opposite hand and down. Good. Excellent. Brilliant exercise. So this is deadlifting. Really important exercise to be doing. 20 seconds gone already. Brilliant, guys. Keep it going. Each time, lifting it nice and close, you're bringing it in. Last 10 seconds. And time. Okay, what have we got next? What's on the list? Okay, dumbbell punches for 45 seconds. Getting ready to go in three, two, one. Let's go. 45. Keep it going. Doing really well today. Let's keep pushing this through. Don't stop now. Good. Just showing you what I'm doing from the side here. Just keep pushing it out. 20 gone. 30 seconds to go. Don't give up on me now. My arms are in bits. 30 seconds gone. 20 to go. Keep them high. Keep driving up. Last 10 seconds. Come on. Push it. It's going to be tough. 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Outstanding. Drop them down every minute on the minute. What's next? Abs. New exercise today, okay? So we're gonna try and bring the leg straight up. So it's opposite hand to opposite leg. So it's like that, okay? 45 seconds, good. Try and touch, good. It's a little rotation. And you just try and get up there if you can. Doing really well. New exercise today. Tough one this. Takes a little bit of coordination as well. But you do it excellently. 20 seconds to go on this one. Every minute on the minute. We're already nearly 13 minutes into this class. Last couple on here. And one more. Well done. What we get? What's next on our list? Okay. Alternate dumbbell clean. I'm just going to take my watch off for this one. Again, you can use anything you want for here, okay? So what we're just going to do is just up and down. We're going to try and get an overhead, okay? So down, overhead, one. Drop, pop it on the ground, get the other one. Good, 45 seconds. Good. On the ground, pop it up. Well done. Pop it on the ground, and up it goes. You're doing excellently. Didn't need to take my watch off for that one, did I? Probably a good idea, though. Good. 15 seconds to go. Down, pop it up. Doing really well. Good. Last few to do on this one. Onto the ground, squat, and drive up. Last one. Excellent. Time on that. 14 minutes gone. What have we got next? We have got single leg step downs, okay? 
we're going to grab our step like that and away we go for 45 seconds just down slowly for a count of 10 and then pop it back up 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 1 down we go 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 2 done down we go 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 3 done 10 9 8 7 6 4 3 2 1 4 done we'll get one more down we go 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 5 done let's check what's on the list and stay with it Arnold press okay so you're gonna grab yourself some kettlebells we'll pop this on the ground again because that's a good idea to have it on the ground here like that and we're doing our Arnold press so it's the closed curtains open the curtains 45 seconds pick a weight that's gonna really challenge you let's go split stance position up we go and down we go good keep with it now you're doing excellently not an easy session today 20 seconds to go keep turning those dumbbells great shoulder strength rotation mobility stability outstanding exercise come on turn them turn them and push five seconds good well done okay now we've got our other single leg step down to do okay are we ready let's get five in again three two one down we go five ten nine eight seven six five four three two one up we go down we go ten nine eight seven six five four three two one two done down we go ten nine eight seven six five four three two one three done you're doing brilliantly ten nine eight seven six five four three two one four done come on we got this ten nine eight seven six five four three two one we'll fit one more in let's go ten nine eight seven six five four three two one single leg stability really important okay what are we on to next anterior raises we got this okay so pick some weights that you're going to be able to drive up in an anterior raise put my watch like that 17 minutes gone guys ready let's go 45 seconds keep the elbows straight just driving them up into that position there doing brilliantly we're well over halfway now keep going come on 15 seconds gone into this one 30 seconds left on this one we are into i put them in three sets we've done the first set we're well over halfway on the second set and we'll be coming into the third set very soon you're doing superb one of our best exercises we are crossfit mania today but we're working still on single leg balance upper body lower body core aerobic conditioning we're working our strength profiles we're working on power you just gotta stay with it now okay last couple we got this yep okay what have we got next johnny boy what's on the list okay we're doing so you can do this with a kettlebell or with a dumbbell whichever you prefer okay so if you do it with a dumbbell you just catch it here if you're doing what it's exactly the same okay so we're just facing thumb back towards palm out and that's a snatch there okay an alternate and again if you haven't got a kettlebell and you want to do this without any weight you can just do a little squat touch of hand off the floor and then back up or you can do it with a light dumbbell it doesn't have to be one of these okay come on 20 seconds ago up the pace if you can keep pushing it good i love it 15 seconds come on two to do last one well done okay let's check where we're at okay 
we are dead bugs. Okay, so grab yourself a weight. We're on the floor. And we're doing dead bugs for 45 seconds. Are we ready? Set. And go. Good. Again, really important to have complete control around the core area. You shouldn't be arching your back. You should be extending out as far as you have control. Once you have lost control of your abdomen, of your tummy muscles, if you start arching, then you've got to bring, you got to pull that weight back up. So we want control, control, control. This is a really good exercise. Last five, four, three, two, last one. Outstanding. Well done. What we get, it is frantic, 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 frantic. Okay, where we are, bent over reverse flies. Oh my God, these ones drive me crazy. Okay, ready? So slightly bent over, just feel the hamstrings back straight, elbows slightly bent, and away we go. We're already 20 minutes in. Come on, we're nearly there. We're into the third set. You are doing brilliantly. Come on. We've got nine and a half minutes left, guys. Stay with me now, come on. 20 seconds of this left. Keep driving it up. Keep driving it wide, keep, keep going. If using a weight is too much, do it without any weight. Superb, five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Ay, ay, ay. What is next on our list? Okay. Um, so we are back on the floor and we are doing bicycles on, on our abs. Okay. Three, two, one. Let's go. Just like that. Opposite elbow to opposite knee for 45 seconds. You just try and get one leg out of the way and then bring that elbow to meet the inside of your knee. Okay, good. Outstanding. 20 seconds gone. Keep pushing it now. If you've come all this way so far, there's no point in giving up now. We've just got to keep driving on now. Come on, guys. 15 seconds. You can do it. Keep pushing it. Keep driving it. It is full on, full on, full on. Last five, four, three, two, and one. Outstanding. What we get again. Let's see what's at it. I am loving this. Okay, dumbbell overhead and press. Grab some weights. Okay. 45 seconds. And away we go. Split stance position. And up we go. I might have picked weights a little bit too heavy for me for this one, especially for this amount of time anyway. But we'll keep going because I'm quite confident that my shoulders are going to manage with this. I don't want anybody getting into any silly stuff. So I'll always pick a way that's manageable. So this isn't heavy, but just for the time that I've got to lift it for, just a fair amount of weight for me anyway. 10 seconds. Five seconds. Two. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh my arms. Outstanding, guys. Come on now. Stay with it now. Stay with it now. We're doing dips, okay? So you can do this on a chair, okay? I've got a box here, which I'm going to use. You can do it anywhere, really, okay? But we have got 45 seconds. We're 23 minutes in. Just like that. Slight bend of the elbows. Feet are on the floor, and we are 45 seconds. I cannot believe that the time is going so quick. Six and a half minutes to go. Arms are on fire, I won't tell you that. Come on, guys. Give me 15 seconds with the dips. Last 10. That's five, two, yep, ay, 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 okay, where are we at? Okay, dips done, dynamic back extensions, okay, so we're going on our floor, on the floor, 
24 minutes gone. Okay. Then we're doing 45 seconds. Feet slightly in the air if you can. And then raising your back up and down like that. Good. You'll feel your back muscles starting to work. Come on, guys. Stay with me now. Brilliant exercise. If you've got low back pain or you're suffering from sciatica, and you've got that kind of, you know, ongoing back pain that has been undiagnosed, and you want to start building up the muscles around the back, then this is a great exercise for that. 15 seconds to go. You're doing brilliantly. Come on, keep it going. Last 10. Five seconds. We don't do enough for this type of core work. This is crazy core work. Good. Brilliant core work. We all think about the abdominals, but we don't think about the back muscles enough. Okay. Single leg heel raising. Right then, 45 seconds. I'm just going to use a little bit of a step there. If you got a step, use a step. If you don't got a step, you know the dance by now, don't you? Okay. And then away we go. 45 seconds. I normally have a slight knee bend on mine when I'm doing them. Good. We're going to need to step after this exercise because we're doing single leg weighted step ups. So we're going to be grabbing a weight um, in a little while and we'll be doing them on one leg and then on the other leg. So this is going to be a really tough way to finish the class from a lower limb point of view. Last couple. Three, two, and one. Okay, so now I've got my step here, and I'm gonna grab a weight, and we're gonna do single leg step ups on one side, okay? Just the one side for 45 seconds. So I'm just grabbing a weight here, and then I'm gonna do my, I shouldn't do this side, because I've just done this side. Okay, so I'm just a little step up, and trying to manage my balance there, okay? And I've got a weight on that side. You can carry the weight anywhere you want. I prefer to carry it here. You can make the step as big or as small as you want. So if you've got knee pain, you might be better off using a smaller step. Good. Come on. Keep driving now. Keep working. We're nearly there. We're coming to the end of this class. Get that balance right. Five seconds. Three, two, and one. Okay, drop the weight, and then we're back onto our. We've got three minutes to go, guys. Come on, let's do it together. Single leg heel raising. Let's go again. Good. Up and down, and I'm so proud of you today. You're doing really well. Like I say, I have a little bit of a knee bend on this one to try and get the lower calf muscles, the soleus and the Achilles, that kind of complex, and all the intrinsic foot muscles as well. It isn't half burned though, I can tell you that. We are nearly there. We've got two and a half minutes left. Come on. Brilliant guys. 15 seconds, feel that burn. Last 10. Five seconds. Two, and time. Oh, ay, ay, ay. Okay, so we've got to do the other side, obviously. So let's get the other side done in regards to our step-ups. Okay, wait however you want to catch it. Two minutes to go. Two exercises to go. And we've done our 30-minute EMOM. What a session this has been. Just managing that balance at the top and then drive through that front leg. Keep pushing up. You're doing brilliantly. 20 seconds to go on this. Stay with it now. That's it. Last five. Okay, good. Next one's a new exercise. Okay, so you can use anything you want. Dumbbell, doesn't matter. We're gonna start 
with the weight behind your head like that. And then we're gonna bring it down to one side, back up around behind the head, and down to the other side, and then back around again. These are called halos. Good, let's go. We are nearly done. This has been an absolute worldly of a class. Keep it going. Great for shoulder mobility, stability, core strength as well. Come on guys, finish out the 30 minutes. We are doing brilliantly. Good. Last few seconds to do. Count it in with me. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh my God. Listen, really class there. 30 minutes, EMOM session. Every minute, on a minute. No repeat. Uh, total body conditioning. What a way to start your day or finish your day. Um, I suggest you try this three times a week anyway. And as you go along, you can progress the weights, make them a little bit harder. And uh, I'll be back with you. See you again next week. Johnny Wilson, Nottingham Physio.